while the world becomes more chaotic, it's time to pull in, to listen deeply to the power that lives within you, a power and a presence that is greater than your intellect, greater than your mind. It dwells within a deep well of silence, a great space within you that exists beneath the surface of your mind. Here you will find clarity. Here you will escape deception, confusion, fear, and anxiety. You're entering the deep well of the mind now. A deep well that is certain, that is clear, and that is not corrupted or persuaded by the outer world. This must become your compass and your guide through the difficult and turbulent times ahead. For the world is undergoing great change, great environmental change, economic contraction and the decline of the world's resources. You will need this deeper compass now to not fall prey to fear and anger, to anguish and despair. You will need this greater presence within you to know how to proceed and to know which decision to make and when to take that decision into action. Your intellect cannot figure these things out. They are far too complex and unpredictable. But the Creator of all life has given you the power of knowledge to guide you, to bless you, to lead you to a greater service and a greater experience in a changing world. Do not despair for others but hold fast to the deeper presence within you. Hold fast, for your life will depend upon your connection, being strong. And that is why it is necessary to take the steps to knowledge, so that you have this strength and this connection, to be your guide and counsel, and to be your compass turbulent times ahead. This is at the heart of all religions, and yet it exists beyond names and places and dates. It is a miracle waiting to happen in you, no matter what your faith tradition, even if you have no faith tradition. God has given you the power of knowledge. You must build your connection now. While things are quiet, while you have time, while you have the opportunity to build this connection so that it may be strong enough not to fail you in times of great need, when you have to face difficult decisions and don't know what to do. You will need this power and this presence because it will not waver, and it will not falter, and it will not bend to persuasions or to compromises. It is the source and center of your integrity, an integrity given to you by the Creator of all life. Learn this. Come to this. Make this your focal point, and you will be able to navigate the difficult times to come you will be a source of inspiration, reprieve, and comfort for those who do not yet have the strength.